Assalamualaikum and welcome back to Teen's Kitchen. Today I'm going to make a chocolate freak shake. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be making a delicious mouth-watering chocolate freak shake. So let's get started. For chocolate freak shake, we have the ingredients. First of all, we need chocolate sauce. For that, we need one cup sugar and half cup cocoa powder and also half cup water and a dash of vanilla essence. So let's go and make the chocolate sauce. So in a cold saucepan, we have to add in the one cup sugar and the cocoa powder. And we will whisk it well. The flame is on low heat. So let's just whisk it. Okay, now I have whisked the cocoa powder and cocoa powder when there are no lumps. So you just want to whisk it until there are no lumps. And then after that, you're going to be adding in half cup of cold water. Ice to ice to. Slowly by slowly. And we're going to whisk it. I'm going to add kevra essence. This, is, this can also be a substitute for vanilla essence. Uh, I just a drop, so it's very strong. So now we will mix it. Okay, when the chini is dissolved or you're happy with your consistency, I will transfer it in a mug. Mein. So, 3, 2, 1. Ready, cup is done. Now we will make a chocolate milkshake. Now I will add 1 cup of chocolate ice cream. Dal dungi. Mm, melt it, but it's okay or not. Make sure you clean the cup well, okay? And then I am going to be adding in the desired milk. About maybe halfway. And then, if you think that you have a milkshake thick or less, then you can add more milk. And then, I will add the milk. A tablespoon of my chocolate sauce. I'm just going to be pouring it onto the spoon. Okay. And now we're going to blend. Ice cream toasty melts. So you can put it in the freezer or the fridge so that it will chill. And then you can add it again. If you want, you can add ice cubes. But I think I like the way it is. To one, we'll blend it. And our milkshake will be blended. Now we will assemble it. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, I have our chocolate sauce. And I will drizzle it a little bit. Let's go down. And I am going to rotate it. So. It covers all the glass in a very cool design. So I will rotate it and I will cut it. It is ready. Let's go for the design. Now I'm going to add a scoop of whipped cream, shake, and then the chocolate sauce. So let's assemble it. Here I have whipped cream. I'm going to whip it. So I'm going to take a scoop of it. And just going to be plopping it down at the bottom. It's okay if it goes on the sides. It doesn't really matter. And next we're going to be pouring our milkshake just gonna be giving it a quick whisk and now let's decorate I add upper curdy whipped cream and here I have my chocolate sauce I'm just gonna be taking a spoon giving the sauce a mix and drizzling it all over like this it depends on how much sauce you want I want a lot because this sauce is incredible as a shake. Okay, now we're going to be decorating the outer side of the glass. I'm taking a little bit and just going to be drizzling it. It's okay if it falls to the bottom. Taking a little bit. Let me just put this back. And just going to be rotating. As so nearly there, dipping it again like this, 
And now I'm going to be adding in, as you can see, these are almonds all cut up and peeled. And I'm just going to add the top. You can choose any other nuts. You can add in no nuts. If you want, you can add in chocolate chunks, chocolate chip, chocolate biscuits. But I think this is enough of chocolate. Just cover the whole top with this. Oh no! <laughs> It's okay, I'll pick that later. Just taking a little bit. And our chocolate freak shake is all ready, guys. I hope you liked it. It's very delicious, especially the chocolate sauce. It's quick and easy. It's a peak. Don't forget to do it. Thank you so much for watching and I love it.